So, who we got in there? Cafu. Yeah. Lewandowski here yet? Hey, coach. Ah, Lewandowski. OK, listen up. So you all know why we're here. A pre-match briefing, coach. <laughs> no, 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 no. Tell him, Rob. Uh, we're here to make an airline safety film. I sell it better than that, Rob. Really? Mm, yeah. We're here to make the greatest safety film for one of the most awarded airlines in the world. Yeah, that probably a bit much, that, Rob. But oh. uh, you've got their attention. And yours, you lovely people on board. This is for you. OK, Rob, back of the net. That means go. Exits and walkways must be kept clear at all times. Baggage should be securely stowed in the overhead compartments or under the seat in front of you. So you heard him move it! In-flight entertainment monitors should be folded away. That's it! Find the space! Slot it through! Close it down! Shimmy to the left! Shimmy to the... Still got it. Thank you. Well done. Continue, Rob. Sorry. Continue, Rob. Please fasten your seatbelt for takeoff and landing. Insert the metal end into the buckle until it clicks. And to adjust, pull the strap to tighten the belt. To unfasten, lift the flap and pull the ends apart. Now remember, when the seatbelt sign is illuminated, you must, and I repeat, must remain in your seat with your seatbelt fastened. If you plan to sleep during the flight, please keep your seatbelt fastened and visible to cabin crew. Down the line. Offside. No, no way around. See? Should have been wearing a seatbelt. What are you lot doing? Seriously, Rob, get a grip. For safety reasons, with the exception of handheld PEDs in flight mode, the use of electronic devices is not permitted for takeoff and landing. <laughs> and such devices must remain switched off I until advised by cabin crew. Please remove all devices from charging yeah, ports for takeoff and landing. If you drop your personal electronic device oh. inside your seat, please do not operate the seat controls. Instead, contact a member of cabin crew for assistance. Thank you, Rob. So, what's next? Emergency exits, coach. Ooh. Come on, lads. Gather round. Please take a moment to locate the emergency exits near your seat. Your seat! The emergency exits are clearly marked and located as shown. As shown! The escape of lighting will guide you to the emergency exit. Exit! In case of emergency landing on water, evacuation slides will serve as rough. Serve as rough! And please remember to remove all high heel shoes before using the slide and leave all hand baggage behind. Perhaps you should just talk us through the smoking bit, Rob. We operate a non-smoking policy at all times on board all our aircraft, including electronic smoking devices. Smoking in the toilet will activate a smoke alarm. Smoking on board the aircraft and tampering with the smoke detectors are criminal offences punishable by law. Careful opening that overhead locker, things might fall out. Brace position. Don't move, lads. In the unlikely event of an emergency landing, please adopt the appropriate brace position. Wall. Now imagine these are seats in front of you. Then you perform this brace position. But what if you're facing backwards in premium cabin? Perfect. Oh, there's a really good atmosphere in here, guys. Why is that, Rob? Well, that's because the uh, cabin environment's carefully controlled, coach. Tell them. Oh, but if oxygen is required, masks will appear from above you. Or you may be required to release the mask by pulling on the coloured flag marked pull. Pulling the mask towards you will activate the oxygen supply. Place the mask over your nose and mouth, adjust the band to secure it, and breathe normally. When your mask is fitted correctly, then you may assist others. So, your life jacket is either beside you, next to you, or underneath your seat. Lewandowski, come and join me. When instructed by the crew, remove it from its container and pull it over your head. Bring the tape around your waist and fasten in front, pulling firmly to secure. Only inflate your life jacket after leaving the aircraft by pulling the two red toggles sharply downwards. No, no, don't all do it! Yes, don't wait until you're outside! I told... You can also inflate or top up the life jacket by blowing into the mouthpiece. No, look... The life jacket has a whistle to attract attention and a light that will automatically illuminate when in water. Infant life jackets will be distributed by cabin crew. Rob, you better run the film while I get this lot sorted out.
To help with final preparations for takeoff, please ensure your seat is in the fully upright position. Your window blind is up, your tray table is folded up, and your seatbelt is fastened. Ah, oh, is that everything, Rob? Oh, you didn't mention the Q-suite door, Coach. Actually, Rob, I felt it deserved its own moment and its own star. Mr. Neymar, uh, if you could just pick up the below the camera. No, the other thing. Take it away. The Q-suite door will be locked in the open position by the crew and should remain open for taxi, takeoff, and landing. That's very kind. Oh. <laughs> You've seen the film. Now read the card. You'll find it in the seat pocket. It shows in detail each of the safety aspects of this aircraft. And if you have any questions, the cabin crew will be happy to help. Of course, if you're travelling in the premium cabin, the Q-Suite safety card is located in your suite, which highlights emergency exit procedures in case your suite door is jammed in the closed position. And now you can enjoy that blockbuster you've picked out from your 4,000-plus entertainment options on your Oryx One.